guys welcome to AKS today in this video we are going to do the unboxing of this FND F700X it is a 5.1 home theater with 8000 watt PMPOs and 80 watt RMS so uh, okay now we are going to do the unboxing let's check out what's inside So the first thing we are getting inside the packet is uh, these uh, these speakers, okay, and this is the remote and the essential wires we need to connect uh, with our DVD player and uh, for the FM radio. Now I'm going to open it. Okay, there we are getting a remote control. These are the three RCA to RCA wires and it, we are going to connect it with our DVD player and this is for the TV or the PC input or you are, if you are going to play it with your auxiliary cable through a mobile and this is the warranty card and the manual it comes with a one year warranty and there is a two AAA batteries provided in the packet. Uh, in the packet we are getting these speakers, we are going to take out the speaker first. This is the front speaker, there is a wall mount option at the back and this is the ABS plastic type. Okay. The wattage for this is 10 watt RMS, it is covered with, okay, now I am going to open it, let's check out if I am able to, okay, I am not being able to open it right now but in future if possible I will open it, okay. So this is the speaker where, this is the front speaker. The wire is not too long, it's uh, medium, okay, I will tell you later in my sound test video. And this is, this one is the same, okay, let's open it, this one. It's a rear speaker with a long wire. This is a rear speaker with a long wire, same, the wall mount option is there, this is a uh, the wires are big almost uh, around 20 feet maybe greater than that I don't know well, maybe longer than that well okay let's keep aside our speakers okay this is our center speaker this is our same front speaker and this is also the rear speaker okay now it's time to take out our woofer. This is the subwoofer. Look inside. This is the subwoofer. We are going to take it out. So there's keeping my there. So guys this is the woofer we are getting inside the packet, look wow, the model is good, it's uh, actually it's a old model, the same the F700U, but uh, it comes with a bluetooth, it supports USB, it supports SD card data, FM is there, remote is there. So guys now about the subwoofer, at the subwoofer in the front of the subwoofer we are getting an IR sensor here. This is the standby button. Okay, this is a standby. It's now it's in Bluetooth. There's a source button there. Now it's in auxiliary. This is both when both the lights are there, it means it's USB. When DVD one single light DVD. Okay, this is the FM and again it's a Bluetooth. And this is the sound, the Pro Logic on or off. You can use the two speakers or you can use the five speakers. This is the volume plus. Or this is the volume minus when it's full it stops blinking man I think so maybe yeah it stops blinking so <coughs> at 
the side of the UFO we are getting the USB slot there this is the SD card slot this is the play pause button this is the next and this is the previous and there are some instructions about the speakers and about the switch at the back side of the UFO we are getting an on off switch there this is the on off switch and here we put our speakers this is the front right front left center rear right and the rear left the cords are like this the cords are like this the white one goes with the white and the black one goes with the black so, okay and here we are getting the DVD input for our 5.1 channel DVD player and this is the auxiliary input for the mobile phone or you can use it with your LED TV or your computer or PC and this is the FM wire which is inbuilt in the UFO and we are not being able to see the UFO since it's built inside the box and I, maybe I am going to make a separate video for that I am going to show you what's the inside the box and where, what, what type of UFO is this the woofer is of 5.25 inches of 30 watt RMS and the speakers are of 2.5 inches of 10 watt RMS. So the total output for the speakers and woofer is 80 watt RMS so you can say it has 8000 watt PMPO. So now about the remote control. In the remote control we are getting the on switch there. This is the mute and this is the numbering for the USB selections of the songs. And here we are going to see that this is the source. And this is the sound, the Pro Logic on and off. You can use the two speakers or you can use the five speakers. This is the Bluetooth dedicated button. And this is reset for the sound selection. What you have set for you, the front speaker centers and the woofers and the bass. And now here we are going to, this is the volume minus. This is the volume plus. This is the tuning for the FM. And this is the scan button. This is the memory. I don't know what for it is. Okay, this is the previous, this is the next, this is the play pause, this is the control, these are the controls for the front centers and rear speakers. You control the separate sound for the rear centers and the front of speakers. And this is the bass control. You can control the bass, you can increase the bass or you can decrease the bass. See, it's blinking. See, it's blinking whenever you use, whenever it stops blinking, it means it's full, it's on high. Even there is no, no display in the front so guys this is my unboxing of this FND F700X if you like this video you can like it share it or comment it thank you guys for watching my videos I'm going to make a separate video for the sound test and I'm going to compare it with the FND F8 F3 800X let's check out what's the difference between the woofer at the front and the woofer in the box we are going to check out that in that video so stay tuned guys thank you for watching